the results of our test and driving the truck were that when we use the device that injects gasoline, uh, we save this much fuel in a half, a, and this is a half a gallon jug, so it would be twice this much for a gallon, and we only use just this much gas is injected into the motor. And uh, so you see, it's a little teeny amount of gasoline saves you a lot of fuel. So that's our results from our test. Okay, this is this is our research truck, and today we're going to take it on a trip and prove that uh, we can get gas mileage or fuel mileage with a uh, five or six point five uh, diesel engine. Okay, it's uh, March, what is it, 26th or whatever? 26th. Huh? 26th. March 26th, 410. Uh, what you're looking up at here is a device that will inject gasoline at a majored amount, controlled majored amount, into the engine, which is a diesel. It's a 6.5 diesel GMC. And we have computer, we have Youngstown University, Mike Wilmoth here, uh, who's going to man the computer and monitor the success. We have uh, a fuel tank here that we, we will use fuel only out of this tank once we get into the measured uh, miles that we run in the course. And you can see the this is a uh, Swaywell bread truck, diesel, delivery truck, a little bit older, and uh, it's been rigged to be a research truck, so that's where we're at. So. Okay, uh, what we got here is, this is our uh, 6.5 liter diesel, GM diesel, and uh, we brought a hose down from, uh, from the pump. And this is a regular fuel injector for a car. And it goes into the uh, intake of the motor. And that's all it does. So this shoots nothing but uh, gas vapor into the motor in a very small amount. And uh, that's how we get the economy. This is, this is how the gas gets in here. These are the wires that run the injector. And this is the hose that pressured hose for gas. And uh, ready yet? Yeah. Okay, just in the record flash. Yeah. It's recording. Okay. We're now on our way to the uh, track that we have laid out. It falls uh, the six pound track. That's exactly how much this tank goes. It should run out in six miles. We've done it about 20 times. It runs out every time. Unit. We're up. Okay. How the circuit basically works is we get a we get a signal uh, per revolution from the motor that we uh, from a device that we hook onto it. What that does is it pulses it, and uh, it pulses the input, and we get a, a signal, and I. From that signal, I can calculate how long the fuel injector should be open. This relay um, turns on the fuel injector, and this one turns on the fuel pump. The fuel pump pumps the fuel out of these little tanks through the gas line to the injector that you that you saw. That gets turned on and off by this. Now, with this program, I can count how many pulses that we ran. The last six mile run that we did, we pulsed just the fuel injector just over 9,000 pulses. So it's not really all that much gas that we were using. For six miles. For six miles, yeah. yeah. And we've just uh, purged the line and... Uh, Refueled with <coughs> 93 octane. Right. So we're, Mike has us all set. We're ready to ready run to another test. He's ready to and, go. Uh, all these gauge, all these little valves isolate the normal engine fuel tank from the uh, 
the test tank that we have here. So, so we'll adjust the fuel level and we'll be all set. <laughs> it should be draining now. Yeah, it, it is. is draining now. This is a research truck that we put together so we can uh, monitor every function of the, the motor from here and that allows us uh, to know our progress. Results of our test and driving the truck were that when we use the device that injects gasoline, uh, we save this much fuel in a half. A, and this is a half a gallon jug, so it would be twice this much for a gallon. And we only use just this much gas is injected into the motor. And uh, so you see, it's a little teeny amount of gasoline saves you a lot of fuel. So that's our results from our test.